Hey guys, this is Rachel Feldman. I am so excited to be here with Ruchika. She has been so kind to give some time today to talk about her experience with the Done Few programs and to tell you how she has used them and how they've been beneficial to her practice. So can you kind of tell me, I know you bought, you know, I don't even know how many seasons you bought, to be honest. I've been doing it since 2014. January. Oh my god. <laughs> so, Except the summer I get all seasons. Summer I just don't work so I don't get summer but I get all seasons apart from that. Somebody even said to me the other day like how many have you done and I'm like you know what I should keep like a little board that says how many I've done because I don't even know um, and it's when I get to talk to coaches like you who have like bought so many and and also get to see like how they transform and how they change also season to season because I think a lot of coaches also think that it's just the same and maybe we change out recipes but um that it's really like totally new content for the detoxes um and sometimes you need the new recipes too because if you have new clients I mean uh you need new recipes people want to try new stuff Well, and I think even when, you know, when people have asked me like about writing it, I always say, no, I literally, I force myself not even to look at the past one. And I just write because I know my clients, they wouldn't just come, I mean, they would, a lot of people would come back just for recipes, but they want new content. They want, there needs to be a new theme. Each season we're supporting different organs. So you want to, you want to educate people. You want to also teach them about also it's never just the food on our plate you want to teach them about different ways to de-stress and and stuff like that so so tell me tell me what you have done with the done free programs so i think uh, let me start why i really got the first done for you program in 2013 november and that'll really say why i got into it or i got hooked into it <laughs> I really like to use that word. Uh, So 2013, November, I was graduating from Institute of Integrative Nutrition. I was seeing a lot of coaches around me sort of stuck and not doing anything or really at the spot where they had left after the graduation. And I just didn't want to be one of those. Mm. I attended one of your webinars, probably the winter launch, which was middle of... So I kind of know the dates that you do (laughs) and sometimes I throw it out on Facebook before you do (laughs) So it was about 19th of November is when you were doing the launch. Yeah. (laughs) I don't think they've changed. I'm methodical. I'm like a little, um, yeah, I'm methodical with my dates. I'm a little like witchy kind of when it comes to like, okay, that's a good date. I'm I'm almost like a football player. And I like that because the other day somebody asked in one of your forums, when is the spring coming? Before you could respond, I just went and said, I think it's usually this date. (laughs) So I like the predictability of it, um, you know, it gives me time to plan and it kind of ties in with the equinox and the solstice as well. So the reason I got it the first year was I didn't want to be stuck and truly I sold my first detoxes within a month of getting it from you. I sold four of them, it was 14th of January, uh, I sold them at $37. I know I broke all rules on the pricing mm-hmm. but I didn't want to be stuck. Yeah. And there's been no looking back. Um, I have, I really incorporate these into my personal life with all my clients, whether they are my one-on-one coaching or whether they are my group coaching clients. So it's really been, if I could use the word launchpad, it's really been that for me. But you know, it's interesting because you say I break all rules and I hear this all the time. Like I think, I see coaches who are like, I'm going for that 99 and they're like, nobody's signing up, nobody's signing up. And I always think of like Ryan Dice, who is this marketing genius master, and a lot of people know him. He always talks about have that like lead magnet program. Mm -hmm. You have that program that gets somebody in there. And for some people, it is a 99 price. For other people, it's a 37. What if a 37 or a 47 brings a person into your business? Get them to start trusting you. And if you're a new coach and nobody knows you, nobody knows that you've been coaching, that's where you're building trust. Absolutely. And so I almost feel like those those programs, those pantry shopping that, you know, these are these are content so you're building trust and visibility. And so I in the forums I actually say to people, hey guys, 
what about, you know, I've had some people who say, I'm going to give this for $27. I'm like, $27, if you can get even 20 people, but you lead them to a one-on-one, -on -one, or you lead them to a 30-minute session or a strategy session, they will come back. I guarantee you, you'll convert them, and they will come back for the next detox when you will raise your price. Absolutely, and that, that's how it's been for me. So uh, that's really, I all, all the year at IIN, I heard this word sales funnel. I think it didn't make sense to me. I heard list building, it didn't make sense to me. So after graduating, it was a good thing that I invested in the program. I got the rock star, it gave me a list. It gave me an idea of what to do with it, what it meant to build the list, you know. Uh, as a new coach, you're just overwhelmed with mm -hmm. creating a website, creating this fantastic looking opt-in. And I did make changes around. I kind of made changes around what resonated with me, who I was and stuff. But, but it gave me a good chance to start without getting overwhelmed with the other other things that really hold people back. Well, it's, it's interesting because I remember sitting in school listening and all I heard was build your list build your list build your list and I was like with what I mean I, I really remember sitting there doing my modules and I was like panicking like what am I building my list with and when I got out of school it wasn't like the internet is today where there wasn't really Odesk at that time wasn't really around Fiverr wasn't really around and if it was nobody really knew about it you didn't have online forums of people saying, I'm a virtual assistant. So I remember coming out and I was like, I don't know how to make Word look pretty. Mm -hmm. I don't know how to make anything look pretty. Mm -hmm. um, so I didn't know how to do this. And I didn't even know that there were graphic designers that made things pretty. So all I knew was build a list. And I saw other coaches with these really pretty things and... Um, and so that's why when I created Rockstar or even Paleo and Revitalize, I was like, you need these list builders. It isn't just about getting a site and saying, I have two 50-minute sessions. If you don't have a list to build or, you know, even if you just get 20 people on that list, if you can speak to 20 people and really develop that trust, they will become your followers and people that buy from you. Right, I mean, and that's what it's been for me. So the last two years, uh, 2014 January to almost February, now 2016 exactly two years and little over. That's what it's been for me, using those lists, getting my own ideas. Because one, sometimes you're just, you know, when you're straight out of school, you don't know what message you begin. Mm -hmm. And the whole logistics of setting it kind of gets overwhelming. So I got myself in motion, I started seeing clients, and I think that's what starts... When you have one client, it gives you the confidence that I can do this. Mm -hmm. When people see results without me having to get bogged down about creating this perfect looking piece of paper or a document, that was big for me. Well, it's interesting that you say that because somebody asked me a long time, like, why did you create, why did you create this? Like, did you become just a business coach and created programs? And I was like, no, I actually was fumbling myself with handouts, with clients, pulling recipes off of, you know, sites, trying to make them look nice to mm -hmm. send to my clients, you know, and from places just saying like, oh, here's, here's a great recipe, this looks wonderful, um, you know, or go buy this book, you know, this looks great for, you know, and, you know, and they were great books, they were from Mark Hyman, they were from our teachers, you know, so I, I respected them and I would say, great, let's read this book or let's read Donna Gates and, you know, let's do this. But what I realized is, wow, it was so much nicer if I could give my client um, just a starting place. And that's what it, it became for me, a starting place to say, here, okay, here are some lifestyle changes that we're going to do. Here it is. Here's a handout. Here it is. And that things were laid out and step by step and 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 pretty and easy and and also that I didn't have to give a whole program. I think that's what I try to say to coaches all the time. Like, you know, the programs, it doesn't mean that you have to give a whole program. If somebody just if you just want to give somebody a guide, give them a guide. If you just want to give them a food diary, give them a food diary. If you just want to give them pieces, you know, half of the time when I blog, I blog from 
a program and I'll just take a snippet of the program. I'm like, phytic acid, you know, how to soak, you know, how to soak, you know, brown rice or something. And that becomes a blog. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now, I've learned a lot just hanging around in your forums. Um, it's been it's been really a good learning experience for me. Well, the forums, what I love about it is that it isn't just me in the forums. It's that there are other coaches that are really in there, I think, truly dedicated to helping each other, mm -hmm. not competition, which is, I believe, so hard to find. Absolutely. I don't see that narcissist like, hey, look, I got this. It's really like, hey, this is what I did. If anyone wants to check this out, this is what really worked for me. Mm -hmm. So it's this... It's this support and this love that is really hard to find in this in this day and age in this world. Um, and you know, I think I think we all have realized that there's a space and a spot for each one of us. Mm -hmm. uh, if we can support each other, it just makes the journey just enjoyable, and you just have that bigger, larger community. Now, have you um, have you bought other programs than the, than Rockstar? Or have you always stayed with Rockstar? So I've done the Rockstar, I've done the Basic, that's what I usually get mm -hmm. every season, and I've also done the Revitalize, the, the one, the Paleo Vegan version that you mm -hmm. have. And what have you done with Revitalize? So with the Revitalize, I've definitely used the Weight Loss Program from mm -hmm. there, that's one of, one of my favorites. Yeah. And a great way to get people in, because sometimes people understand the word weight loss a lot mm -hmm. easier than digestive bloat or energy or something else like that. With the Revitalize, I think I haven't done it like a complete 28-day program, but I use the e-books a lot. Yeah. Uh, I use them all the time with my clients. It doesn't have me have to create a new document each time for everybody. Well, and what I love about those e-books is they really focus on taking somebody step-by-step, -step, just really chunks like, hey, on this day, just let's really put focus on putting yourself first. Think about five things. Or five ways that you can put yourself first today. Mm -hmm. And so it's really taking somebody. When I wrote that program and I thought about what I wanted to do or what I wanted my client to go through, I thought about a very busy person mm -hmm. and taking somebody step by step through, through transforming their life. Yeah, absolutely. You know, I and daily email as well sometimes. Yeah. I mean, even with the weight loss, when I when I wrote that, I thought weight loss is not just about the food on your plate. It's about giving somebody a guide to kind of step back and nourish and, and nourish, nourish self. And I think that's what, when we look at programs, we think that it's just food. So mm -hmm. it's so past food. It's about oh, okay. self-care, self-love, everything. And that's why, I, I think that's why the, the programs are different. And I think that's why so many coaches come back because there's that content in there that can go into like spirit, body, and mind and, and those different components as well. I will tell you why the pro why your programs are different. I will really tell you it's not the content, it's you. Aww. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm, genuine, I'm serious. And that's why I was really feeling bad that I missed the interview on Tuesday. I wanted to tell you that I've kind of been in touch with you for two years, but we've never spoken to you, but you've been a part of my life. And it's just, just the willingness that you share stuff with on the forum. You don't hold back anything with the fear that, I could be almost raising competitors here. You do not have that. Ah, uh, that is, you know, for me, honestly, and I, I've said this always that I feel like my job, because I hear so many times coaches saying, I spent five grand at this school. I spent another five grand at this school. I bought every program. And I know there are, there are great programs out there. And there are great opt-in freebies that I see. And they're great this. But what I found is I bought... I bought one program once and I was really disappointed because there was, not only could I not apply it, I couldn't, I couldn't do anything with it, but there was no support. Mm -hmm. And I was like, how am I supposed to have success with this? So, and so when I see coaches and when I talk to them and I talk to a lot of them, when you don't have that support, then why, then, then you stay stuck. So you have to get into a place. And, but I always say it's, you have to be gentle with yourself because some people get it real quick and yes, you get 50 right away. But what I love that you spoke about is, you know, that yes, you broke all the rules in the beginning, but you have a sustainable business. And I think that's so important for coaches to hear is that 
like don't quit keep working at it and you know and keep learning but stay consistent because what you learn and what you apply is then you have this profitable business that you know that feels good and you also make it to what is significant for you Absolutely, absolutely. And you said it right. You know, I've recommended this program to a lot of new coaches, a lot of people who are asking around. And some have been very local to me and they've always had that questioning look that why would you want to share this with us? And I say, because I truly have, if I've learned one thing from Rachel is that there is a time and place for everybody. Mm -hmm. Everybody can survive in the same place. Yeah. We will all attract different people. So I think I really have learned that one thing from you. Uh, you are, thank you so much. I mean, I, you know, it's interesting because as I said to you before we, um, we interviewed, I said, I don't have questions. This is whatever you want to say. Mm -hmm. And whatever comes out of your heart is what this, this interview is meant to be. And so I and just... Truly from my heart, it's truly nobody said that. If I didn't say it to you today... <laughs> Your life wouldn't be any different, but I wouldn't be different. No, my life is different. And you know, if you hadn't had this, you would still continue the way you were. It would probably be different if I hadn't said it, but uh, that I had to say it to you. So. Well, so. thank you so much. Can you share with everyone where they can find you if they want to find out and see? I always say to coaches, check other coaches out. Don't steal what they're doing admire what they're doing and look but can you tell people where they can find you um your site facebook so my website is ruchikabehel.com which is my first name last name and i'll spell that it's r-u-c-h-i-k-a-b-e-h-a-l.com and you can find me on facebook and instagram on nourish your life that's my that's my motto that's what i believe in that it's really not your food. It's everything that we do that nourishes our life. That's beautiful. Thank you, my good friend. Seriously, it's been just a true blessing to be with you. you. Thank you so much. It's been a pleasure that I could finally connect with you. I'm yes. Very, very... Well, I feel like I know you. I, I mean, I was saying I feel like everyone in the forum, I feel like I know them. I feel like I know their life and and the connection we have through the many many years and even those who come in new it's like instant sisterhood and some brothers are in there but it's like instant family instant community and you're right about that i think that that's what really um i tell everybody whoever i recommend this program to a lot of people get it is that not only the content not only rachel's expertise but you're really going to get a forum that's really like a mastermind group mm -hmm. so you, you're not paying only for the content you're paying very little for this mastermind group people pay hundreds of dollars to be part of yeah and groups so this is really a mastermind group you can almost say throw out a title and say does this sound right and somebody will be online and respond to yeah, it yeah that is true so that's what i really love about this forum. i wouldn't uh, and that's why some people ask me why do you buy season after season i say i think i just want to be hanging around <laughs> I really just do that well thank you so much for being you know with me today and I appreciate this and enjoy the rest of your day and I will see you this spring absolutely <laughs> take care bye, bye my friend thank bye. you